look like a little baby deer with no eyelashes and no eyebrows right now, but that is because we are doing a makeup tutorial that was highly requested. Now this is a continuation in my $1 makeup tutorial series. So every product that I am about to show you was only $1. <laughs> and I will have it all linked below on where you can buy these. So I just finished a how to color correct and conceal video. I will have that linked here and it's really easy. Obviously it's really affordable and let's get right into it. Okay, the first product we're gonna use, of course, is eyeliner. It is in black. It actually is like a two in one. So the bottom is a black liquid eyeliner. The top is like a black crayon eyeliner and I am going to fill in my water lines on both the top and the bottom. Now I have to say, in terms of eyeliner, this is definitely not my favorite, and like I said, I will always tell you guys if I think a product is good or not. I don't really like this product, to be completely honest. But yeah, like, I mean, it comes off good there, but like, when you're doing your water lines, it's so hard. Like, I don't know why. It feels like impossible. Ooh! Ooh, ooh, I tickled inside my eye and it did not feel good. I may have to do this out of frame because I just really need to focus. Okay, so this hot water line is done. And I got some inside my eye and that is not feeling so great. So actually, we're gonna take this out. This liquid liner is really, really, really good. I like the liquid liner. This pencil liner for your water lines is like not making the cut and it's like making me half blind. <laughs> that, we're not using it. Ooh. Okay, so the eyeliner is done and we look like baby raccoon, which is exactly what we want. Next, we are going to grab our eyeshadow. Ooh, and it kind of glimmers. Like, it doesn't have any type of glitter in it. You can use this wet or dry. This is what I did for mine. First, we grab a brush. And then we are going to wet the brush and put it directly on the palette. Okay, the brush is wet. This is good. This is exactly what we wanted. We are going to dip it in here, and you can kind of tell, like, this palette is getting a little wet. But you kind of need to, like, pick up a good amount of product. Our brush is, like, fully painted in purple. I went directly on the center of my lid and just started patting that on. Now, it's, like, a metallic purple, and it also gives almost this, like, blue gleam about it, which is why I matched it with the blue eyeliner. Let's pat that all on. And then I went into my inner corners. And up into my crease. And my outer corner. This is like our second coat, right? And the brush is still a little bit wet. It's not like how it was before dripping. It's so full coverage now. It's so deep. It's so pretty. Ugh, I love purple. Like, I'm obsessed with purple. Just pat on another second layer all over the place. So the brush is getting kind of dry now. We are going to wing it out. A baby bit not even wing it out just extend it a little bit past our natural crease or the natural outer corner of our eye I like to do this just to like open up the eye okay so we are all good with the eyeshadow at the moment we are gonna wait like two seconds for it to dry a little bit more and we're gonna grab a nice clean brush that doesn't have any product on it yeah you can see in the middle it's still a little wet so we're gonna go on like the sides we're gonna be real sneaky about it we're gonna go on the sides and grab some of that dry powder and then we're gonna go right above the crease again and we're just gonna put that there the reason for this is when it's dry it's a more violet like a more pink violet shade so i like to give it a dimension make it look like you're using three shadows a blue a purple and a pink when you're really just using one in different ways then if you want i'm not even positive if i did this in the last look but get another clean brush a thinner brush put a little bit of dry product on there and just do a little bit under your lash line so next we're going to grab the eyeliner. The eyeliner of course was a dollar and it is also a combo. It is a little crayon eyeliner on top. Hey, crayon eyeliner. And uh, the liquid liner on bottom. So we grab our brush. Look at how cute this is too. I love that it's like round because you can just sit it on stuff. We grab our liner and we do like, I always do it from the exact middle of where my top lid meets my bottom lid and then I wing it out. And we wing it. So now we are going to... We've got our wing. We need to connect this to our upper lash line. Okay, that wing actually is looking pretty freaking good. So we do need to let this dry. While we are waiting for that to dry, let's just do our other eye. Okay, so now we have both eyes done. We're gonna wait like two minutes for it to just dry completely because with this one, you actually need to do two layers, two coats of it. While we wait, I've never used this before, but I also got this for a dollar. It is an eyebrow pencil. Comb our eyebrows up. Actually, this product for a dollar, 
not that bad. Not quite my shade, not that bad. This is the lightest shade they add to, by the way, which is like, I think it's soft brown. So let's just have like a very light hand. Okay, this product may definitely not be my shade, but let me just say, in terms of drawing on little fake hairs, this product is like grade A. If I had darker hair, I would use this product day and freaking night. This is like so dark. Like, if you guys can just appreciate though, like these baby hairs, goodness gracious. All right, let's comb this out a little bit. Try to make this look a little bit softer. Yeah, it's dark as heck. We'll lighten it up later, it's not a big deal. It does a really good job though, like I have to say, product quality wise, it's a good product. Time to do a second coat of our liner liquid. Okay, do it. Okay, you see how much like more vibrant that side is now? Two coats is where it's at. Let's grab our blending brush and we're just gonna like blend this out just a little bit. Next we are gonna do a little bit of mascara. The mascara I am using is not a dollar. However, I am using all of these fake individual lashes and they are all super long and those are all a dollar. I normally do um, six individual lashes on each eye. I love fake lashes and the fact that you get all these individuals for only a dollar is crazy. So we dipped it in the glue. Let's wait like 10 seconds for it to dry. Okay, and then we're gonna stick it on the outermost corner of our eye. Okay, and that's our first lash. Now I'm gonna just check back up on you guys when I have all of the lashes on one eye so I can show you guys the difference. Okay, so here is one eye with the fake lashes, one eye without. So like, look at how long and full they are. Not really anything. For $1, these lashes are freaking crazy amazing. They are so long and like, Look at sure he is. Let's completely look down. They are so, 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 so long. I love them so much. So let's finish the other eye with the lashes. And that is the finished look. So this is the recreation. So I was using all dollar products and I will have them all listed below and I hope you guys like it. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not and comment if you wanna see something else, if you want me to continue this $1 makeup tutorial series. And if you guys have any suggestion on a look you guys want to see for just a dollar. Like I said, I'm going to try to create each and every look that you guys tell me to do for a dollar. I don't care if it's crazy. I don't care if it seems like impossible. I'm going to try my very hardest to do it and I will either have it on my Instagram, which is this, or I will have it on my Snapchat, which is this, or I will do it right here if it turns out to be really good. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you soon. Love you. Mm -hmm.